Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to some more, uh, Don't Starve with Weber, our cute little, uh, spider monster creature stuck. Oh. Well, <coughs> oh, excuse me. Uh, spider stuck in a terrible, disgusting, uh, six-year-old's body. Uh, or maybe it's vice versa. I can't really remember. But, uh, some of you guys may notice I am using a, a new microphone. Hopefully it doesn't sound terrible. I'm not entirely sure. This is my first time really testing it out for uh, a video. It may actually be worse than my previous mic, in which case I'll switch back over and this will be, this will very soon be a distant memory. Uh, but, you know, I figured I'd at least try to figure out, uh, if it's any good or not, you know, if it's worth keeping around at the very least. Alright, so we've got some silk. We've got some pig stuff. Let's go to survival. Can we make, what can we make? We can actually make an umbrella now. We only need one pig skin. And, uh, and two silk to do it. So we can actually make a decent umbrella rather than the piece of crap that we've had. So there we go. And uh, we can go ahead and get rid of that. Because once it rots, it's gone forever. So, you know, there's not really much of a reason to keep it around. Now, if I remember correctly, last time I said what we really needed to do was we needed to go up and dig up a whole bunch of rocks because we need rocks for quite a few things. And we also need a lot more wood and we need charcoal. So one of the first things that we're going to be aiming for is food-wise, we're going to try to get a, um, look, a bucket of poop. Less poop on hands, more poop on plants. Okay, then. So we need poop to make that happen, but it's actually pretty close. Alchemy engine. We need to, what we're trying to do is build our way up to an alchemy engine. Oh, look, I've, I've started to create a beard. <laughs> That's so odd. Oh, and we have a chance to immediately start using our umbrella. Now, from what I understand, the umbrella will actually, like, severely decrease how wet we get. Um, so, like, by a pretty significant margin, so that's, that's a plus, I mean, to be perfectly honest. So, what we're going to do is just kind of dig up a whole bunch of rocks, and, uh, while we do that, I will talk about... I guess we'll talk about some of the things that, uh, that, that's happening. So, first off, one of the reasons, uh, why I haven't been uploading as much... Uh, ooh, but my pickaxe, I actually need, like, I'll probably need a couple. One of the reasons I haven't been uploading as much, I know I said this, I went into detail a little bit about it last time, but my new job has, it's mostly evened out to where I, I kind of know what I'm doing and what's expected and everything, but there are some days where I have to stay late, I have to work overtime, because uh, I get busy, you know, I get busy doing what I'm doing. Um, Maybe in the future, I mean, I've said this a million times, but if you guys are new to my videos and, and you haven't watched as much, you know that my eventual aim, like most people who do YouTube, is to eventually be able to do YouTube just full-time as a job. Uh, in which case, I'll be able to put a lot more effort into my videos, and I'll also be able to produce them a lot more uh, regularly, which will be a huge plus. Um, honestly, I'd love to make more videos. Uh, but sometimes things just get in the way and I can't do it. Uh, every single day, and it's a pain. It's really, it, it, it's actually pretty sad. I mean, I really wish that that wasn't the case, but it is. Alright, let's eat some of this cooked monster meat. That's pretty good. I'm really happy about the fact that I don't take negative effects from monster food. That's actually really amazing to me. Maybe I should up there and get some twigs and some uh, pig skin as well. But I've also been messing around with, uh, there's also been a couple of other things that I'm doing, uh, that I'm dealing with, I should say. And I don't really want to go into uh, what it is, because right now, it's it's kind of on the fringes. I'm not, I haven't even really started it. I've been looking into getting it started. But it is very, it, it, it's actually something personal. It's, it's not something that I'm trying to do for the channel. It's not something I'm trying to do for YouTube. It's, it's something personal that I'm trying to take care of. It's not something I wish... Uh, it's not something I, I'm, I'm glad that I have to do, but it is something that I will... that I do have to, to deal with again. Alright, so you still get wet when you're using this umbrella. It just... it drops. It's, it drops how wet you get, like how quickly you do. Um, is there a way to... Will this tree actually protect me? Or does it actually do nothing except protect you from the heat? It looks like it just protects you from the heat. Let me take this off. No? 
No, it actually, it, do, it does, uh, it does protect you from the rain a little bit. Huh. Well, I do need some wood. Like I said. I need wood for several reasons. Ah, oh, shit, that thing's angry at me now. Is this thing? I think I hear it like fighting. Walk the birch nut tree. See, I'd really like to be able to kill this thing. Ah, oh. didn't manage to actually attack the uh, the bird at all. I really would like to kill that thing though. I wonder if I can. Damn little... No, I'm not dealing with that. Go away you little birch nutter. Fuck off. Alright, fuck you. And I'm st I still have to deal with this bullshit. Am I actually taking damage or is it just flashing because now I'm low on health? God, I really want to be able to kill that tree. Uh, for multiple reasons, but the primary reason is because, you know... I'll get, uh, I'll actually get living logs from it if I manage to kill it. The weather pain, the weather pain. That is such a fun little item. But it's really hard to make. Obviously it's because you have to kill a freaking giant to even make it happen. Which I don't think we're anywhere close to. Okay, we can't make the football helmet yet, actually. It's surprising, I thought we could. Alright, dress-wise, a straw hat. Helps you stay cool and dry, so it actually does fight the uh, effects of weather. Which is a plus. So why is my sanity going down? Am I scared of the dark or something? Like exceptionally scared of the dark? That could very well be the case. Uh. Oh shoot. Why didn't you... Make a torch. Alright, there we go. So this is working. Also, my sanity is still pretty steadily going down. I don't know what is making that damnable noise. I really do need to make a, a shovel, though. So there's a little bit of health gain back. I'm gonna have to think of some of the other ways that I need to, uh, to make health. Alright, so I can actually go ahead and plant those, that's a good thing. So these berries are still wet. I'm assuming that means they're not as effective. I'm surprised food and stuff gets soggy. Uh, but let's see, what else was... So what else was I gonna talk about? Oh, also, I guess being near the fire actually... Oh, no, 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 wait. Depending on how hard it's raining. Of course. Makes a difference in how wet you get. So this is pretty good. Also, this thing does seem to, to wear out after a little while, so I may have to... I may have to go ahead and shave the beard here before too long. I mean, I may not be able to get it, like, full length. I don't know, though. I think it only takes nine days uh, for you to max out your beard, like, to get yourself the full beard length. Well, those fireflies, for whatever reason, they're not actually producing light. I can't even click on them. Huh. That's weird. That's a little buggy. So... There is a, uh, there is an update that's supposed to be coming out for Don't Start fairly soon. I think I've gone, I think I've already gone over everything that I'm gonna go over, uh, concerning why it's taken me a while to actually, like, 
do my videos. Why well, I haven't been doing my videos as uh regularly. Stop it. Alright, so this thing's turned back. Good. Cause I hate it. Alright, what else do we need? I ain't fucking with these birch nut trees. I did not realize that this still happened. Birch nut trees. The birch nut like the angry birch nutters or whatever they're called. <clears throat> Uh, birch nut guardians, I'm assuming, that's what people have taken to calling them, that's not actually what they're called right now, but people just call them birch nut guardians, because they're basically like the tree guardians, only, they only appear from birch nut trees, and, uh, they obviously act a little bit different, the mechanics are a little different concerning how they function, and like, their, their, uh, character AI and all that kind of stuff. Anyway, they're a pain in the butt to deal with, uh, that's without a doubt. But they do, they are a lot easier to summon, so I'll give them that. But one of the things is that, like, I, I don't think they're supposed to appear as easily as they do. And I really hope that my microphone isn't, like, the sensitivity isn't off the chain. Because I did lower the sensitivity a bit, but it may be kind of ridiculous. And if it is, I apologize. Um, I'll have to, I'll have to check just to be sure. When I was recording stuff earlier, it wasn't, but I feel like I'm hearing a little bit of feedback. Um, I don't know. Maybe it's nothing. Hopefully it's nothing. But we'll find out very soon. Okay, so what do I need to do? I need to, um, probably be a good idea to just go ahead and use up this pickaxe. So let's just go bust a rock. I think we have enough to bust down two rocks, actually. Or not two rocks, but we'll be able to bust down one and a little bit of the second one. So what are the main things we need right now? Let's see. We're, we're good on stone. We've actually got a decent amount of gold. We don't have a ton. we actually got a good amount of gold. Which we can use because we need cut stone and we need charcoal. Oh, we do need charcoal, don't we? I didn't even think about that. All right, well, let's go ahead and produce some charcoal then. We'll go ahead and burn down this little portion of, like, forest? It's not really a forest. Okay, good. Good, we're doing well. We need enough... Wow, that's actually waterlogged charcoal. Because the tree was wet, I guess. You would assume that since you burnt the tree down, that it would no longer be waterlogged. Uh, or at least I would. I would assume that since the frickin' tree has been burned down that it would no longer be wet. <laughs> but, you know, don't starve rules. There are no rules. Don't starve, do what it do. And you just have to deal with it. And hope you can live. That's fine, though. It's not that big a deal. Alright, so we got a little bit of charcoal. I want to get one more piece. I would like one more piece of charcoal. And then uh, also, I'd like to cut down a bit more trees. The dust is actually getting kind of decent now. It's not super long, but it's not super short anymore either. Oh, shit. Well, I wonder if that'll actually put out the fire. No, it didn't. It did, however, start, stop it from spreading to the other trees, I, I guess. Uh, maybe not. Maybe it's because they're wet. Maybe the fire doesn't spread nearly as much now because, uh, everything's wet. That would be logical. And again, I'm not exactly sure about Don't Starve Logic, because some things it really follows to the letter, and it's like, alright, that's sensible, that makes sense. Other things, it's just like, nah, fuck that. I know it makes sense, but fuck that. That's not how we're rolling. So, I don't know. Let's just go ahead and eat this fucking carrot. Let's see, what else? Let's get this hammer back out and get the rest of the charcoal here. <clears throat> oh, I should also try to make a piggyback, but I think I need an alchemy engine for that. However, I think I have everything else I need. Let's see, how far away are we? We're not that far from camp. I actually thought we were closer, though, to be perfectly honest. It's kind of surprising. 
Let's see, what all do we not need to? Uh, we should go ahead and try to eat some berries. There. We're done with the berries. That's good. We got the flint. We got rocks. Ooh, what's going on? Oh, I went the wrong way. Not paying attention. We got some wood. We got spider eggs rocking out here. Shovel, pine cones. The pine cones are good. We, we actually need to plant those. I really, really need to plant those. I think that the rain actually makes, like, the grass and stuff grow faster, which is good if that's the case. Check out this little glitch. It's, like, glowing. As if there were fireflies, but there clearly aren't. I don't know, maybe they'll show up later. Alright, let's refine, let's refine some board. Let's also use this. There, we made some charcoal. We made some wood. Now, food-wise, food-wise, food-wise. Uh, oh, we can actually make a drying rack. That's... I didn't even think about that. Might look into doing that. A crock pot. I need three, uh, cut stone. Let's go ahead and refine some cut stone. Alright, good. Good, we're rocking the cut stone. Let's go to the food section. Now we're rocking the crock pot. Let's make another one. Bada boom. Alright, one of our goals is done then. Um, what else did we need? We needed boards for something. I know I need boards to at least make a treasure chest. At least one treasure chest. Because I have things here that I really need to put up, like the niter. I don't need to carry niter around with me everywhere I go, or silk. Spider eggs I don't need right now because um, I'm not going to use them until I find a place to put them. Seeds? Uh, the seeds I may cook, actually. Pigskin. I don't need all that pigskin. I don't need to, you know, keep it with me. Uh, rope. I'm not exactly sure about the rope. I'll just keep it, you know, just for now. It's not doing anything. Let's go ahead and shove the gold nuggets up in there. Now what do we need to get to the alchemy engine? Cut stone, boards, and electrical doodads. Well, I can I can definitely do the electrical doodads. I can make those happen. Uh, Alright then. Well, that's going to be it for this episode. We're going to start off on day six. My beard should get a little bit longer here, so I'm going to go ahead and show you that once it happens. If I remember correctly, it's just every three days. Uh, nope. Maybe later. Maybe it'll get, uh, longer later in the day. Or maybe it'll be on day seven. Since you start on day one. Uh, I'm not sure. I don't know. But I think it's every three days. So maybe on day ten is when he gets max beard growth. We'll see. But, uh, until next time, guys. This is Sage. And, as always, peace.